Okay, I bought us a car wash. Hey, so, here we go. Nice clean whip. Nice for this thick trip. Whip. <laughs> <laughs> Makes the ladies and gents go. guys so today I'm here with my brother Tate I feel the need to say my brother because in the last video that he was in everyone was like who's Tate <laughs> he's my brother if you can't tell today we are doing a ballin on a budget with a little bit of a twist I've seen this on YouTube a little bit and it is the $20 thrifted outfit challenge but today we are doing the $30 outfit challenge I've also seen that maybe it our works. thrift stores are more expensive but Pants are like fifteen dollars. Might have to bump it up to sixty. <laughs> We're doing the five thousand dollar outfit challenge. Wait, and I didn't even say, but so Tate is buying my outfit <clears throat> and I'm buying his outfit. That's the twist. Yeah, wait, I didn't even say that. So Tate is going to go in with thirty dollars and pick out an outfit he thinks I will like, and I'm going in with thirty dollars picking out an outfit he will like, and then we'll reveal it to each other and try it on and see how the other person did. First and foremost, we need a little bite to eat. We are arriving at Tim Hortons for a snick snack. A sniggity snack snack. I'm gonna get the ham and cheddar sandwich and a honey dip donut. Honey dip is like my new obsession. If you guys have never had it, please try it. I'm pretty sure everyone has tried it though. I'll go for ham and cheddar as well. Just the sandwich? Just the sandwich. Did I get the sandwich in between two honey glazed donuts? <laughs> Just put it between the donuts. Yeah. I'm kind of nervous going through the drive-thru. You too. Hi. Look at that thing. There's my sandwich haul. Just one mm. second. The bagel right. haul. We will punch back when we get there. Three hours later. Park right in between these punch buggies. Wow, what the heck? I feel safe in between two punch buggies. Okay, okay. we are officially here. We're excited I'm and excited. ready to shop till we crop. Mia's talked this place up a lot. She it's says true. it's the best Goodwill. I've, I've only here. actually been here once. And it was good. Yeah, it was great. So we are officially in. I'm currently looking for what I'm going to get Tate. I'm in the sweaters right now because winter is coming. Whether we like it or not, winter's on the way. So I'm gonna pick out my stuff first and then Tate's gonna take the camera and pick out my stuff. Let's get looking. Tate! I forgot to ask Tate what size he wears in pants. I gotta go find him. He's probably like looking at stereos or something. Hey Tate. <laughs> what size are you in pants? Like jeans? Yeah. I think I'm like a 32 length. 32 waist or 30. 31 ish length. 32 waist. 32 waist. All right, I gotta get started. All right, so I got an idea. I have a picture that I wanna recreate. So it's kinda like that. All right, Tate's gonna take the camera for a little while, but I'm just gonna keep looking. I've been hunting for a bit. Not very long yet. Found this sweater. Kinda going in blind here. Found some red jeans. They're like corduroy. They're in Mia's size. They might be good. Could be retro if I pair them with something cool. Something retro to go with those. Ooh. You would hate that. Here's your camera back. Thank you. I took some really, really amateur quality Back stuff. up. I don't want you to see. So I'm back. Sorry in advance for whatever Tate took. So what I got so far is completely different than the picture I showed you guys. I got some skinny jeans. They're like black but off, this green shirt, and this weird like sweater vest. So I'm gonna try and find a fanny pack to wear over his shoulder. I'm like trying to be more high fashion than I actually know how to. I still have 10, like $10 in my budget. Five actually, crap. Okay, we just met up. I'm hiding everything I have. Tate's hiding what he has. Are you done? I just have to choose between two sweaters. Sweaters? I'm basically done, so. Okay, I need five more minutes. So I basically just looked through the entire store. 
I looked through the entire store for a fanny pack. Like, I'm sorry, how does this thrift store not have any fanny packs? I only found one. It'll have to do. It doesn't really go with that outfit, but whatever. I'm going with the red corduroys. They're pretty red, but I think it's a statement, maybe. Now it's just about choosing a sweater that I want to pair with. I got this gray knit one here, but got this blue one here too. I don't know. There she goes. I'm gonna go with the blue. Take a chance. Okay. <sighs> it's so hot. These sweaters are so well insulated. Okay, so let me check my receipt. Tate's still in there paying. He was taking too long. I just had to leave him. My total was $24.47. So definitely came in under budget. Something was on discount 50% off. I don't even know which one it was. So I got $3.75 off. I came in under budget no matter the sale or not. I thought it was going to be so easy to find a fanny pack because I wanted Tate to have to wear one across his body because that's like a thing now. We will see how it goes honestly. We will see. I see Tate. He looks stupid. Tell the camera how you did. I think I did pretty good. Do you? I actually think I, I kind of, I'm not, I think I nailed it. Oh. Not gonna lie, I really think I, <laughs> I, think, I think I hit a home run. All so. right, we're gonna exchange in the car, but I want to go somewhere a little less busy, so hold on. How do you think you did? I think I did good. I already said how much mine was, but you have to tell them how much was yours. $36. So Tate's was 36 and mine was 24. So basically, if you even it out, it is 60, so 30 each. So I got this purse. Okay. Oh, oh cool, and it's a wallet on the inside. Oh, it's handy. <laughs> I grabbed this belt. It's just like a thin leather belt. Oh, I like this belt a lot. Army green jacket. Okay. It's size small. I oh, this probably is can. nice. Here's right. where it kind of took some liberties. Took okay, some yeah, because this is pretty basic so far. Yeah, yeah. Red corduroy. Wow. So that's where the 70s is. Red corduroy pants. That looks like a very nice okay. fall outfit so far. One more thing. Okay. There was two sweaters that I had that I was like, which one of these do I choose? And <laughs> I decided to go for like the kind of like the more uh, statement one. Okay. The, oh yeah, this is something that I probably have owned at some point in my lifetime around 2007. Sure. Like this, this is going to look very cool together. This, this is a little shorter, so I figure like it'll come down to like just above the jeans. Okay, it'll definitely be more color than I usually wear. So now I will show you what I got and then at home we'll try it on. Try to make it very, very high fashion. I'm excited to see this. Okay, so first thing I'll just start off basic is this is the shirt very nice and then to go with that i got you these off black jeans this is where in the style kind of hits the wall so to wear over your shirt and undone is this black vest sweater oh, oh man wear this undone and then the last thing fanny pack is gonna yes. go over your chest that's like that. awesome so that's your outfit all right i'm into it we're gonna fast forward to when we're at home and we're gonna try on the outfits and see how we did we have errands yeah we have to pick it's up gonna a be like a second for you guys, but for us, it's gonna be probably two hours. It's gonna be a day when we get home, we'll be really tired. So we'll see you guys then. We have to get a modem. Okay, you guys, so we are officially back to our house. This is where we're gonna be trying on everything. There's Tate. And as you can see, there's also no furniture. So mm -hmm. it'll be house. perfect to show the outfits off. I want you to try your outfit on first. All right. Bring it in. Okay. First of all, this, can this go any longer? It looks cool though. Let me just pan you. Pan me. I think we should cool. close the door. It's kind of a mess. <laughs> People don't need to see that. I mean, it's a style. I was trying to go for a Yeezy style, but it looks like kind of expectations are reality. Yeezy. Uh, I think it turned out pretty well. Actually, yeah, I do like it too. So now I'm gonna get into my outfit. 
So you can stay in here and okay. then I'll pop in. The grand reveal, the best outfit, the winner, the 30-ish dollar. All right, come on in. Ba -na 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 -na, bum, bum. Pretty sweet. Recording. Definitely something I wouldn't usually piece together. Uh -huh. Like it's not my personal style, but I actually surprisingly think it like goes. I did not think that this sweater was gonna go with the pants, to be honest. But they actually, it kind of is a look. I definitely feel like Velma from Scooby Doo. Right. Yeah, yeah. Individually, I like all the pieces, and together, I actually like them. That's cool. It's kind of fun. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why it works. All right. So that is the our finished thirty dollar thrifted. Outfit challenge. Let us know what you think of our outfits down below. Mine's like kind of 70s and Tate's was a wannabe easy man. <laughs> Happy that everything fit us at least. Yeah, no, it actually all fit really well. Totally. We did yeah. good. <laughs> That was a good <laughs> high five. So anyways, if you guys like this video and maybe would like to see more like this one or you're interested in watching more of our Ballin' on a Budgets, I will link the playlist on the screen. Thank you, Tate, for being in this video. We love doing them. They're fun. They are lots of fun. Me and Tate love thrifting, we like do. just in general. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see more, make sure to click the subscribe button. See you guys in the next one. Bye!